LDS church members Susan and Rachel Brock sexually assaults and exploits child in Chandler, Arizona. Susan Brock of last known address, 4465 South Virginia Way Chandler, Arizona pled guilty to three counts of attempted sexual conduct with a minor. She was originally charged with suspicion of sexual conduct with a minor, molestation of a child, furnishing obscene materials to minors and public sexual indecency. After taking the boy to remote locations in the desert, Susan Brock, paid the child anywhere from $25 to $100 to let her touch his genitals, photograph his genitals and have oral sex with him. The boy would ask her to stop what she was doing to him, Susan would refuse to stop and make threats. She then further traumatized the child by stating she would kill herself before police could ever get their hands on her. The Brock's daughter, Rachel Brock, was charged with eight child abuse counts for abusing the same boy as her mother. When Rachel Brock began having sexual encounters with the boy at her mother's encouragement, Susan Brock was teaching Rachel Brock how to be a good LDS church prostitute for other LDS church members. According to court records, Commissioner Hank Gooday had the discretion to sentence Rachel Brock to up to 10 years of probation and a deferred one year in jail. Rachel Brock has been indicted by a grand jury on five sexually related counts of sexual conduct with a minor and furnishing harmful materials to a minor. While Susan Brock was being sentenced to 13 years in prison, she made the statement that all LDS church members make after they are arrested on sex crimes. From this point forward, I choose only to do good. And I will make this up to everyone that I've offended some way. To anonymously report a Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints child sex predator. Contact the National Center for Missing and Exploited Children 24 hours a day at 1-800-843-5678. Or go to https colon slash slash report dot cybertip dot org. The Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints are the first to falsely call other people sexual deviants however, the Mormons are the biggest violators of all sex abuse and rape laws. The state of Utah, the epicenter of the LDS Church, has the highest child sex abuse cases in the country. Joseph Smith condoned, advocated, and participated in the molestation and rape of children. It was just as wrong then as it is wrong today. Today's Mormons make excuses for Joseph Smith and secretly continue the practice.